everybody for the win attach here. You know what it is. About to hit up all these stops, son. All these stops. I'm going to first got, get this one. Uh, we got a couple eggs that are about to hatch, so perfect timing. I believe they're both 2K, in fact. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and check this one out. We got 1.9 out of twos, and then we got three 5K eggs that I just received um, while I was walking to campus. So, it is Friday. It is a, actually a while before we're actually going to release this episode. I'm actually going to go ahead and head on over to the main part of the campus, which is this way. Boom. Which is where that gym is, uh, the Mystic Gym. I'm about to hit it on over. Look at all those Pokestops, son. We're going to try to get as many in as possible. My first class got canceled, so I got a good hour and a half before I have to get to my next class. So we're going to try to get as many Pokestops in as possible, get these eggs hatching, and go from there. We're going to try to hatch as many eggs as possible. There's a Vulpix nearby, which is very good because I do need one for a nine tails. So hopefully we can get these eggs hatched. There's two that are on their way. The five kegs and uh, the five kegs. I know I will not hatch right now, uh, but that uh, we'll get some decent amount of walking in. And yeah, not too much else to go on right now. So see. What All right, we went from zero to two real quick, son. About to hatch these two eggs ASAP, Rocky, right now, son. Let's go ahead and get these ones in. Come on, start us, start us. Ooh, goddamn Spiro. Don't even need. Don't even need. But don't stress, don't stress. Let's go ahead and get rid of it. It's not even decent. I mean, it's decent, but it's not great. I know there's a Pokestop here, so that's why I'm trying to like stall for time so I can make sure I get this Pokestop. Hopefully we get a cool 10K egg today. Two, oh, dose in a row, man. Are you serious? Two times in a row? Are you joking, bro? That is so bad. Two Spiros out of my two 2K eggs right away. Hopefully we get an egg from this. We did, let's go ahead and check it out. What is it? Please be good to 2K. God damn. All right. I doubt we're going to be hatching anything anytime soon. But for the time being, I'm going to go ahead and bring you guys back up to speed with what's going to be happening here. As you guys can see, there's all these Pokestops all over campus. So I'm about to hit them all up as much as possible. If I bring, I'll bring you guys back if I see anything cool. I'll bring you guys back if anything decides to hatch. And I really doubt it because I won't be walking 5K or 4.7k whatever it is right now and uh, or even the 2k might hatch actually but the 5k's I doubt they will hatch so let's go ahead grab all these Pokestops as many as possible I'm gonna go all the way down to the south end of campus and then bring it all the way back up to the north end of campus so it should be a pretty decent walk and it'll also give me an, an idea and an example for next time how far I need to walk and how far I'm actually gonna be doing so if I do walk that 5k I will be able to know uh, what travel and what course to take so let's go ahead and grab all these pokey stops and I'll catch you guys in a bit you guys don't even know man this is like pokey aid for college students there's so many pokey stops you guys talking about there's three in a row by your house Psh, you guys don't even know there's over 50 probably close to 80 pokey stops here son Everywhere you go, everywhere you look, there's a Pokestop waiting for you to get them Pokeballs in. Especially those potions, especially them eggs, and especially it's a great walk because you'll be definitely be able to hatch as many as possible. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright, there's absolutely nothing nearby except Pidgeys, Spiros, the occasional Harambe. There's just absolutely nothing nearby except Pokestops. That's like the one positive I'm getting out of this, especially getting the KMs in for the walking. I'm about to cross some like super duper construction zoned area, but first let's actually go get this Pokestop up here. See, what did we got? A Pidgey. What did, I, what did I just say? There's nothing around here except goddamn Pidgeys. Hopefully something rare pops up soon and I can bring you guys back, but it's really pointless to be showing you guys how many Pidgeys and Spearows I'm capturing. I did catch that Harambe. Oh, I got Eradicate and a bunch of Rattatas as well. Those are the other two that are kind of common over here. Um, but we're going to go ahead and continue our walk, continue our journey. There's really not much going on here except a bunch of Pokestops. So hopefully we can hatch at least one or two of these eggs before my next class. And uh, we're going to continue gathering these Pokestops as much as possible. So I'll catch you guys on the flip side, son. Finally, something worthy to show. We got a Pikachu, a Parasect, a bunch of Pokestops. We got a gym going on as well. Oh my gosh, whoa. Looks like this Pikachu's using an Electro Ball, son, without the electric. Alright, so we're about to capture this Pikachu. It is a really bad CP Pikachu, but I've actually caught quite a few on this campus, so they're not common, but they're like just above that, so I would say they're kind of uncommon. They're not rare. I mean, I've seen quite a few of these 
and I was able to capture that one pretty damn easily. Uh, we do got this Pokestop here that is nearby, uh, Team Valor repping it up on the gym takeover. And we're also going to be able to get this Parasect now. I just want to see, I already have a Parasect. There was a bird nearby, I couldn't tell if it was a Spearow or a Pidgey. It is a 215 Parasect, so it is very bad. I'm going to capture it anyways, just because um, I've been capturing everything. The one thing I do hate though, is when you find that Rattatat or that Pidgey and they just, you, you throw a bunch of Pokeballs at it, runs away and it's like, really bro? I just did all that walking for all these Pokeballs and you're just going to come along and do that to me? So, we're going to go ahead and now that we got this one taken out of the way, going to go ahead and transfer it. Get it out of the way, we don't need it. Uh, it was a Pidgey, so let's go ahead and see if my theory is true with what I just said. It is a, I mean it's a bad Pidgey, it's not even good. Uh, let's go ahead and see if my theory is true. We're going to go ahead and throw that one Pokeball. Hopefully it goes right away. That's how it should be. That, that, right there, that's how it should be. I don't even need it. I'm just capturing it for experience points. I'm almost at level 25. I got 85 candies. Again, I don't even need it at all. Going to get this Pokestop in as well. And we've actually been doing quite a bit of walking, which is very good. Um, we are, I believe, halfway on these two Ks. Just above halfway and halfway. It's so perfect. On the two Ks, I might be able to hatch. Actually, wait, nope. I'm not even going to be able to hatch them. But I'll get them very, very close. So I'll be able to hatch them probably tonight or something. Um, but yeah, I'm going to continue. If I find again anything cool like that, that was freaking beast sauce right there. Um, I will definitely go ahead and bring you guys back. Let's see. Can I get through here? Yes, I can. I can get through here. So perfect. See you guys in just a little bit. All right, found some shade. About to hatch these two 2k eggs. Hopefully it's both of them. I know they're very, very close. Uh, one just popped out on um, its 2k, and it is a Caterpie. Just, come on, where the start is that, though? Where the start is that? How, what's the CP on this one, though? It's not too bad, but it's not good enough. So we're going to go ahead and transfer this one. Uh, hopefully there's another egg. Yes, it is. So I'm definitely not going to be able to get these 5k eggs hatched. Uh, we have three of them. Maybe four. It's a Pidgey. I, I've caught so many of these on the way here. Really? The, the two Spearows, a Pidgey, and a Caterpie thus far. That is really, really bad. I've caught plenty of them on the way. Uh, let's go ahead and check out my Pokemon really quick. I gotta check out those eggs. So we got three 5Ks that are about halfway, and four 10Ks. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill up my bags. My bags are almost four, 641 out of 650. And uh, so we need nine more items, and hopefully we can get uh, two more eggs. And when we do, I'll go ahead and recap to you guys really quick what eggs we got. So you guys know and you are up to speed on what we're about to get here. And, yeah, hopefully we can find any cool Pokemon. There's a Tauros nearby, but I don't really need it. Uh, my Tauros is okay. Uh, but for now, let's go ahead and get these nine items and two eggs. And then we're going to go ahead and head on over to class. So, catch you guys in a bit. Alright, now that our battery's almost down, we got about like 14, 13% left now. Uh, we did get those two more eggs to, uh, to refill. And go ahead and show you guys really quickly what they were. They were two 5k eggs. One, I believe, is at... No, they're both at zero. Oh, one's at 0.3, one's at zero. And then the other ones are at 3.0. So, those were the two new eggs that we got. So, we got five 5k eggs that are about to hatch pretty damn soon. Uh, we'll definitely get them into this episode. And then after that, where are the 10k eggs at? I have yet to see one for weeks on weeks on weeks. I've had these four 10k eggs for a while now. I'm not sure whether I should be even saving it up for the nine 10k egg video anymore. I don't even know because I really want a Lapras and that's the only Pokemon that I need out of the 10k eggs. Um, but the other ones will be great for candies as long as they're not single evolution. Uh, like a Dratini I'll take, uh, Eevee I'll kind of take it. Um, but I won't be happy if I get like Onyx, Magmars, Electabuzzes, Pinsers, all that stuff. Hitmonlee, Hitmonchans. Don't really need those too much. Aerodactyl will be cool because they need a better one. But uh, yeah, since we're almost out of battery, we're at about 12%. We'll probably be 11% in a couple seconds here. Um, I'm going to head on over to class. We're going to call it here for the day. And uh, if you guys are loving and enjoying the videos, go ahead and be sure to throw a thumbs up on the video. Go ahead and throw a comment down below if you have any questions, got anything to say, go ahead and throw it down below. But yeah, got not really nothing in the area anymore, and uh, we're about to head on over to class now. So I'll see you guys in a bit somewhere else. Not too sure where yet, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much pretty much it here today. Because I did not know I would use that much battery uh, just going around for let's say we were going around for an hour and 20 minutes, and I've used probably 90% of my battery. So without further ado, 
let's go ahead and catch you guys in just a little bit somewhere else. Somewhere else, especially after the battery charging. Peace. Alright, so I have no clue what's going on. Windy as right now, and it's very actually wonderful temperature for a walk. So I decided to get my egg hatching in to end this vlog. Uh, let's go ahead and check it out. We've got them four or five Ks, and we've got one at 3.7, two at 3.8, and one at 0.8. So my goal is to walk 4.2 KMs, get these four or five K eggs hatched. We're gonna take a couple stops by like one or two uh, pokey stops, but uh, nothing too much. We're just basically gonna be walking back and forth around my community, around the other community that is next door as well. Um, again, our goal, get these five, uh, oh, we got five, one, two, three, four, five, five K eggs. Uh, one's at 1.1, I did not see that one, so uh, but the lowest one is at 0.8. So we got five five K eggs to hatch. Uh, we're trying to get Porygon, we're trying to get Licky Tongue, and uh, these Poke Vlogs are always going to be coming at you on Saturdays and Wednesdays, so always stay tuned. Twice a week we release these vlogs. I'm not sure how long each one always is, but uh, we're going to get these uh, 5k eggs hatched as quickly as possible. And we do have a female Nidoran and a Nidorino nearby. Um, I already caught the Nidoran. There was actually two by my house, so I'm not sure why they're showing another one, unless there is really another one nearby. But, um, yeah, let's go ahead, and we're going to start off by going to the next door community. Uh, some of these eggs should already hatch by the time we get there, so we will be able to uh, restock, hopefully, on some new eggs uh, from the Pokestops that are over there. Check out the gyms. I'm really not going to do any gym battling. Uh, trying to collect as many as possible. As you guys already know, we're trying to, we're at 117 out of 142 that I can possibly get. There's the, oh no, there's a Nidoran male. It's at 411, which isn't too bad, but I don't need it. Uh, I have tons of candies on a lot of individual types of species. And uh, I'm not really doing anything with these candies except uh, power leveling my Pokemon now. I've already used, overused all of my Stardust, so I'll go ahead and give you guys a quick example of what my squad's looking like right now. It has definitely changed since the last time I power leveled because I actually was really bored last night and couldn't think of anything to do. So I got the 2142 Arcanine maxed out. Snorlax 2117 maxed out. Flareon at 1767 maxed out. Needle Queen at 1747, I believe it is maxed out. Yes. Uh, Gold Duck at 1701, and I believe this one's maxed out. Uh, Needle King at 1694, that is maxed out. A Rhydon at 1617, this shouldn't be maxed out. Oh, it is maxed out. Uh, we got an Executor at 1599, which isn't maxed out. I have plenty of room for him. Clefable at 1586, which is maxed out. Uh, we've got a Pidgeot at 1405, I know for a fact that it's maxed out. Um, a Vaporeon at 1404. Uh, definitely not maxed out, but I am definitely interested in power leveling that pretty soon. And we also have a Hypno. So my Pidgeot all the way to Arcanine. 1, 2, 3, 4, 6. My first 10, my top 10, they're all maxed out. And they're all good to go. They got great and uh, brilliant move sets. So without further ado, I just did a lot of rambling and talking. But that's my squad. If you guys got any questions about anything else on Pokemon Go, uh, go ahead and post in the comment section down below. But again, probably won't be seeing you guys until probably the next egg hatching. Uh, because we only have a right horn that is nearby. So not too much going on. But uh, yeah. Without further ado, I'll catch you guys in just a little bit. Alright, as you guys can see, I got those two Pokestops over there. I was caught, but I basically pulled a hashtag IDGAF over there, and uh, I, I just kept walking. Security guy, it's the same security guy that I caught on camera in like episode 2, I believe it was, um, a Poke vlog. Um, I'm not going to go back, of course, because he's just sitting over there, but I mean... I'm not really doing anything wrong. I'm just walking over there and walking back. As you guys can see, I walk from this direction where the blue dot is. Way over there though, my community is next door. We're allowed to walk through, but we're supposed to come up this street where I am instead of going one little street over there. And it's pretty much only like 15 more extra steps for me to walk over there. So I just go ahead and walk over there and then I come back through. And when I come back through, it's the, uh, 
there's two gyms. One's on the church, which is the yellow one, and then this other one's the Mystic Gym, which is right next to me. They're both at, they're both uh, gates are locked, so I can't get into them. Um, but I'm not going to go back and get those two Pokestops. I'm actually going to go ahead and walk back home through that community because I want to see if the security guy says anything. I mean, I'm just going to be a, Mc, a McDouche right now and walk through there. And I was going to actually walk all the way around because to see if I find any other Pokemon. But I'll walk through back to my community and then we'll go ahead and do some more walking through my community all the way back up to the top. We're actually going to do a lot of walking today because, again, we do have four, uh, five 5k eggs that are going to hatch. Two, three of them are very, very close. One is at 1.8. So I'm very close to hatching that as well. Um, it's good 3.2 left. And, uh, yeah, those 10k eggs. I Out of those three Pokestops, of course I didn't get an egg because of the fact that I can't. I'm actually full on eggs right now, but I'm waiting for this Pokestop to hatch, and I'm actually going to try to hatch the three eggs that are at 4.7, 4.8, and 4.8 by just walking back up and forth, and once those have hatched, I'll go ahead and bring you guys back. I'll grab this last Pokestop. Hopefully, I can get one egg out of this Pokestop, and uh, then we'll go ahead and head on back home, but uh, yeah, for now, let's go ahead and get some walking in. Get that point two, the point two, son. Here we go. Egg numero uno out of three. Hopefully, hopefully we can get three eggs out of here. Oh, oh, next level. It's back. I finally got all 21 candies. Way to bring it back. I will definitely take this. Ghastly, welcome to the crew. I've recently evolved. Well, I haven't recently, but I've evolved my Ghastly into a Haunter, so I never had a Ghastly anymore. Oh my gosh, it is back. Ma, Harambe. I find Harambe's all day. I don't need it, don't need it, but Ghastly's back. Alright, so let's see if we can get an egg. I guess we only were able to hatch two out of the three. No egg, damn it. Alright, fine, there's no egg. We do need that Geo dude. we do need that Eevee. But now we finally have, uh, subtract seven from the 124, we have 117 different Pokemon now with us today. So out of the 117, we have 117. So I have one of each individual Pokemon maxed to their CP. Not the ones that I haven't evolved yet. Uh, the ones that I haven't evolved yet. I mean, I just haven't evolved them. But we're going to go ahead and walk back to our community. I'm going to go ahead and cut through. And uh, we'll go ahead and walk on the, the top of my community. See if we can find any cool Pokemon. Uh, but we do got a couple more eggs to hatch. And I know one's going to hatch very soon. So catch you guys in just a little bit. Alright, so here's that third egg. Real quick, three out of five. Porygon, Licky Tongue, you guys know what we're aiming for. Oddish. I'll take Oddish because we do need a Vile Plume. We do need a lot of candies. Hopefully the candies were good. 21 candies, 95 out of 100 candies. Oh, that is next level, son. I cannot wait. We're going to get another new Pokemon to the crew soon, but we do got to find another, a couple or at least two more Oddishes. So, got two more eggs to hatch, and I'll catch you guys just in a little bit. Alright, everybody, the eggs are about 0.5 away from hatching. Just found a 273 Vulpix. I've been doing actually a lot of walking. Let me get this one in. There we go. I've been doing a lot of walking. Uh, we just found a Vulpix. And the reason why I brought you back for the Vulpix is just to keep you guys up to date with the eggs going on right now. And, and, we've got a Vulpix. I definitely need a Vulpix. We do not find these in our area too much. It's actually not, It's I'd actually consider it a rare Pokemon in our area. Please, oh, no, 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 no. I'm sorry, you're not running away on me, bro. Uh, I actually really need you. We're going to Ultra Ball this. And the reason why I really need it is because we need Ninetales. We need Naruto, bro. Oh, my gosh. Come on, man. Come on, mate. How's my Ultra Balls getting all flung side to side, son? So, hopefully, we can get this uh, Vulpix. And I'm not too sure how many candies we've got uh, towards the Ninetales. I don't think we're very close. Uh, but we did just capture the Vulpix, which is very cool. Uh, I got that XP. And we've got 24, so we're about halfway now. Uh, so that's not too bad. There's a couple Pokemon that we're halfway. We got an Eevee and a Venonat in the nearby. And let me go ahead and check out really quickly. We're almost over 25, which is going to be cool. That's going to be a milestone in itself. Uh, we are roughly playing 90%. Uh, but that's going to be a milestone in itself. But let's go ahead and keep walking, get these eggs hatching, and I'm going to call it a great night. I know it's dark. Porygon, licky tongue, bro. Come on, mate. Come on, mate. Gra oh, fuck. Growlithe, man. Why, bro? I don't need you. 734, guess what? I don't care. I don't need it. I don't need it. You guys know what we're going for. We're going for Porygon. 
or Licky Tongue. Porygon, Licky Tongue, and Lapras are the only three that I need from eggs. Lapras, of course, you get in the 10Ks, so hold that out of the question. Porygon and Licky Tongue are the only ones that I need out of eggs that actually mean something that will be new to the Pokedex. Uh, there's a couple of them like Machop, uh, Eevee, no, Eevee's a 10K, Machop, uh, Bellsprout, Volpix, Gastly's, um, Abra's, those will be cool because I do need their third evolution like Machamp, Alakazam, Gengar, all that stuff. But uh, the True Trues, I know it's very dark guys, it's just super late. Uh, the True Trues that I need are Goddamn Porygon, which would be super amazing, and Licky Tongue, like, that, that's, just, that's up there, it's up there. But I've been going for Porygon for a very long time, so hopefully we can get them soon. Perfect lighting, kind of, not too bad. Uh, this is going to be the last egg that we're going to hatch, last thing we're going to do for this episode. So I just wanted to say really quickly, thank you very much for tuning in. Got any questions, post in the comment section down below. Like, favor, subscribe to the video and the channel. Let's get to it. Just don't give me a Growlithe. Like, back-to-back -back Growlithe, that's just going to be, like, mind-numbing. But, uh, oh, god damn. I'm joking, guys. I do not, I don't, I don't, I don't, I, I, I don't even, I, I don't even, all that walking... And all we got was pretty much a ghastly. <sighs> 117 Pokemon still. It's been like, what, two weeks now that I've been sitting on this number? Been grinding the goddamn candies, but yeah. Didn't get too much out of those eggs. And I'm not too sure what to do with these four, uh, these four 10K eggs. I haven't been getting any eggs at all. I'm going to try to grab a bunch tomorrow, and if I don't get any... Post in the comment section down below. What do you guys want me to do with these eggs? Because you guys want me to just go ahead and hatch them. I don't know what to do. It's been like a month now that I've had these eggs. And I haven't gotten a new 10k since. So I've tried. I will keep trying. But for now. Thank you very much for tuning in. Further one Itachi is. Out.